Hello students, welcome back to our maths class. So last class we discussed about algebraic expressions. So in that uh, we learned about the terms, uh, what, what is meant by algebraic expressions. That means terms are combined to form algebraic expressions and about the constants, about variables, then about coefficients, right. So today and also about the like terms and unlike terms. So today we are moving on to the next topic that means how to add, how to subtract algebraic expressions. So in that uh, we can discuss how to add this to expressions. That is 3x plus 11 and 7x minus 5. So here we want to add that to expression. So 3x plus 11 plus 7x minus 5. So, the main stuff is we can add, we can subtract only the like terms. Okay, we can add or subtract only the like terms. So, here you see, we can first we can combine the like terms. That means, see here, here it is 3x, here 7x. So, we can combine that two terms the, and we can enclose in a bracket. So, here 3x plus 7x. So, here we want to add and next uh, constant term. What are our constant term here? 11 and minus 5. That we enclosed in the another bracket. So then, then uh, we can add. See this 3x plus 7x. 10x plus 11 minus 5. It is 6. Here again we can't add. Because uh, here both are unlike terms. 10x and 6 both are unlike terms now. So again we can't add. So we can stop it here. So this is our final answer. This way we are adding two algebraic uh, two expressions. First we are club the, first we want to club the like terms and then we can add or we can subtract. Got it? Next up. How to subtract? Subtract minus 5y square from y square. How we can subtract? So here minus 5y square from y square. So we want to start from where? Yes, from y square. So that is we can write as which is equal to. That means y square, you want to subtract, so minus sign, then the, what is the next term? Yes, it is negative 5y square, that should be enclosed in a bracket. So this step is very important, while subtracting, while subtracting to uh, expressions, we want to first we write y square then we want to uh, give the minus sign and then we want to put a bracket and then write the next term okay that is equal to y square the negative then we want to open the bracket that is negative into negative positive so positive 5 y square so here see both are y square terms so that means they are like terms. So again we want to add. So see this y square, y square. So here if there is no any value that means it is 1. So we can add first 1 plus 5. What is 1 plus 5? 6. And we want to write that algebraic factor like that itself y square. Okay just to add that numbers only. That is 1 plus 5 it is 6. And then you want to write the y square. Got it. So this way we are adding and subtracting the algebraic expressions. Next we can deal with the addition. How we can add. Okay. See this expression. Next question. Hmm? So here see this first expression add 5n minus 7n comma. 3n minus 4n plus 2. That is second expression. Next, 2m minus 3mn 3 3mn 3 
minus 5. That is the third expression. So we want to add this. Okay, how to add this? So that means we can first we can connect using addition symbol. Three expression. So that means 5m minus 7n plus 3n minus 4m plus 2. Okay, plus next expression 2m minus 3m and minus 5. Got it. Next, what's our next step? Yes, we want to club the like terms. We want to club like terms. So here, see this m terms, 5m, next comes 4m. So that all we can enclose in bracket, 5m minus 4m, next comes 2m plus 2m. Okay, next term. Next term, we want to enclose in the another bracket. That means n terms. That means 7n, 7n. Then comes s plus 3n. Then comes, ah uh, yes, no any other n terms are there. Only two n terms are there. Okay, next term. Next term, see this constant term. Before that, mn term is there, isn't it? m into n term. So, no any other term is there. So, we can write like that itself. That means negative 3 m n. Only one term is there with m n. Next, we want to club what? Constant term. So, we can enclose in bracket. Which is the constant term here? Yes, 2 minus 5. Okay. So, this way we club the like terms. m terms we club. It. Club together. n terms. Again, we enclosed in the another bracket. Next to 3 m n is alone. So, we write like that itself. Then constant term. Okay. Next to see this. How we can see uh, this is the m terms. So we want to uh, add or subtract that number. See this 5 minus 4. 5 minus 4 it is 1. 1 plus 2, 3. So 3 m. So m we want to write like that it's so just uh, do this 5 minus 4 it is 1. 1 plus 2, 3. Next, n term. Negative 7 plus 3. What is negative 7 plus 3? Huh? It is negative 4. Okay. So, negative 4 n. Okay, n term we enclosed in the other bracket. Next, minus 3 m n. That we no need to do anything. Next, plus 2 minus 5. It is negative 3. 2 minus 5 it is negative 3. So that is equal to 3m plus into minus minus 4n minus 3mn. Then again plus into negative negative 3. So this is our final answer. All are unlike terms so we can stop it here. You got this? So here first here we want to add this 3 expression. So uh, we want to collect the like terms first. So we collect the like terms. M terms we collect together. Then N terms. Then comes M and then constant term. Then uh, we subtract uh, this 4 minus 5 and then we add this to that answer is 3M. Negative 7 plus 3 it is negative 4N. Negative 3M and 2 minus 5 it is negative 3. Next 3M minus 4n minus plus into minus it is negative 4n minus 3mn again plus into minus negative 3 okay all are unlike so we can stop the calculation there okay got it so next uh, we can move to next question that is find the sum of 3x minus y plus 11 and minus y minus 11 and subtract 3x minus y minus 11. Okay. So, first step, we want to add these two expressions. And then we want from that, an that answer, we want to subtract this, this expression. Okay. So, first we can add. Okay. So, how we can add? This two expression, we want to find the sum. So, that is 3x minus y plus 11 plus Negative y, negative 11. Okay, next expression we enclosed in the bracket. Okay, next. 
3x. Next we want to open the bracket. 3x minus y plus 11. Plus into negative it is negative y. Then plus into negative again negative 11. Got it. Here actually if there is no any number it means it is 1 itself. So negative uh, 1 into plus in plus 1 into negative y it is negative y. Again plus 1 into negative 11 it is negative 11. Then what is our next step? Yes, we want to club the like terms. All steps are similar. Okay, here club the like terms. Here x term. Ah, uh, yes, here there is no any other x term is there. So we can write as 3x. Okay, next uh, s minus y minus y. So that we can club in the another bracket. That too, we can club in another bracket. That is negative y, negative y. Okay, next uh, see this. Plus 11 minus 11. Okay, that we know. Plus 11 minus 11, it is what? 0. We can cancel here. Okay, that means we can write as 11 minus 11. That is actually our answer is what? 0. That is equal to 3x s plus s. Negative y, negative y. So here there is no any number. So that means it is 1 itself. So we know. Negative 1, negative 1 it is negative 2. Okay, negative 1, negative 1. We want to add and give the negative sign. So that is negative 2 y. Then see this 3x plus into negative, negative 2 y. So we while adding, we got this answer. So first we want to find the sum of these two expressions. Okay, so we uh, add this. That is 3x minus y plus 11. We must open the bracket. Negative 11. Negative. Uh, plus into negative. It is negative 11. So we clap the like terms. And finally we got the answer as what? 3x minus 2y. Got it. Next. Uh, next uh, from this answer. We, we want to subtract this. So. That is. 3x minus 2y. This is our answer. Then we want to subtract 3x minus y minus 11. Okay. That is. So here O bracket is there. So we want to open the bracket. 3x minus 2y. So first we can open the bracket. Negative into 3x. It is negative 3x. Negative into negative plus y. Negative into negative again plus 11. That is equal to, see this, 3x negative 3x. Yes, yes it is 0. Next up, negative 2y plus y. Next up, plus 11. This is our answer. So, we can cancel this 3x and negative 3x. So, negative 2y, y is, it is negative y plus 11. Okay. So, this is our answer. Okay, students, got it? So, what we done here? 3x minus 2y. First, we open the bracket. So, we can cancel this 3x. One positive, one negative. No. So, we can cancel that. Otherwise, you can write the 0. Next, then negative 2y plus y it is. Yes, negative y. Next, plus 11. So, this is our answer. Okay, students, now you got how to add and how to subtract algebraic expression. Okay, hope you all understood. Thank you.